folks, this is Alan Tyson for Lee Hill and Johnston Insurers. Well, boy howdy, have things changed around here since our Bluebirds carted their third straight season as semi-finalists in the race for the FCS National Championship last December. With a brand new athletic director and the continuing support of our administration, students, and fans, the prettiest little stadium in America is getting a much needed expansion and facelift, and our football operations building is under construction as our birds say goodbye to the Southern Conference to become members of the Sun Belt. FBS, baby. But hey, as wonderful as it all seems, to get where we need to be, there has to be sacrifice. And we have a group of seniors who have shed their blood, sweat, and tears over the last three years and now are sacrificing their last opportunity to win the national championship so that the future of our football program can shine bright. These guys are pioneers and they're heroes and they deserve to be treated as such. So I urge you to come out to Paulson Stadium this fall and support this group of student athletes who have meant and continue to mean so much to our university. Folks, the future is now. Come join the journey. As for today, it's Labor Day weekend in South Georgia and our Eagles are teeing it up for the 400th time in the modern football era as Savannah State has motored to Glen Bryant Field for the 10th meeting between the two schools. Having gone winless in their first nine tries against our birds, I'm sure these felines from the Garden of Good and Evil will be fantasizing about a win right up till the opening kickoff, the point at which reality sets in. Folks, I look for this to be a record-setting day on the ground for our men in blue as we pick up our first victory of the season. Cole caught these cats, Eagles.